everybody! I feel like they're just cut out. Hello everybody! Um, I am going to do a very casual haul, maybe not haul. There is a shop in my town, country, not sure how far out it goes, called Home Bargains. And if you couldn't see from my picture, I did a pretty big shop. Now, this bag is big, like big, big, like half the size of me. I was sweating taking it to the car. I just want to say I bought everything in this bag for about £45 and I'm pretty impressed with the stuff I bought. I always go here for like, I'm so, this is such a casual video by the way, like I've had my hair cut and it's not styled right now because I've been like, I've just got back, I want it to be fresh, I wanted to like not have anything unpackaged yet so it was legit and I have like no makeup on, I'm in my gym stuff because I'm yet to, I've like half worked out, you need to finish working out and I'm ready to go and I'm just gonna un unpackage as I, like I'm just gonna <laughs> I'm gonna buy, I'm obsessed with home bargains, as you can tell by the name, it's a bargain store. I'm just gonna stop rambling. Right, let's just get started, shall we, before you all like click off. Okay, first things first. So I'll try and remember how much I paid for everything. Bella's down here getting super excited. Right, first things first, this is a cat bed. Um, I'm about to, shall I unravel it on here? I can always edit it out if it's too much. Okay, um, it's just a cute little bed and I'm about to make so much mess. It is a giraffe print and it was four pounds. How freaking cute is this? So it's a little domey bed. Look at it, I love it. And then you get a little pillow and the pillow, I bet you Bella likes this more than the cats like this. And then voila, a cat bed, four pounds guys, four pounds. Like, and can I just say, I love a good bargain and also the stuff that you can buy from this store, it's not even bad quality. Some of it is brand stuff and you know whatever right next thing uh, right i have a story for you and i don't know bella i don't know whether i should tell it or not okay no okay i'll tell it i'll tell it i can always cut it out this morning this little one decided that her litter was not clean enough for her like standards and so she decided to go and take a poo on the dog bed yeah not for any reason, she's not ill, she's not anything, she just did not want to use her litter because it was not clean enough. I have now cleaned it, but I was not impressed, so I had to throw away Bella's blanket, but for £2.50, I just dropped you. Anyway, as I was saying, for £2.50, um, I got this, so it's got a cute little doggy on, it's a pet blanket, and it's pretty big, like, I could wrap myself in this. And that's just to replace her other one that Mrs. pooed on this morning. So I got that, that's £2.50, so £4, £2.50. Next thing was this, I, so I need a new just pan and brush. I'm really anal when it comes to like cleaning and stuff. I can't remember how much this was. I think it was £1.49, £1.50. It's just pretty, it's standard, but I just thought I'd, whoa. <laughs> but I just thought I'd show you anyway. Uh, loving this. Next, I'll try and get the boring-ish things out of the way. Puppy pads. Now, Bella is fully toilet trained, but when we go out, sometimes we leave her for like two or three hours and she will need to go. So she is trained to go on these puppy pads when we are not at home, which is so good because I could not be bothered trying to pick up pee all the time. So yes, thank you, Bella, for being smart. Next, not interesting. Oh yeah, these are like 49p revolution i look so awful next cat litter i just changed the cat litter before but i got another one so 3.8 liters it's the if you have a cat the gel litter with the crystals i would highly recommend oh my god it stops it from smelling it's easy to clean and like i just honestly and it keeps the urine and, and i know this is gross but it keeps everything in honestly it's the best thing ever this one was only two pound fifty you can get more expensive ones but this works just as well so if you can get the cheaper version like bargain bargain home bargains bit of promo for home bargain i am obsessed with this it is amazing and i wouldn't recommend anything else we've been using it since like someone else recommended it to us next in my big bag of everything uninteresting things um <coughs> almost choked to death sponges Da -da -la. <laughs> um, I just needed sponges for the house. I love these ones. I think they were like maybe 70p, I don't know, for six. Bargain. I'm probably doing all the math wrong. If anyone's sad enough to add all up, you'll be like, excuse me, what, 40 pounds? You've done something wrong here. Whatevs, we've still got stuff to go. Next, microfiber cloths. Now, I'm not a fan of dusting. Nobody cares, probably. 
But these are great for dusting, cleaning and wiping and whatever. I'm obsessed with cleaning, guys. Obsessed. Um, next, me, most... Uh, uh, I'll just keep doing the uninteresting things. So, Mr. Muscle. Love it. Use it all the time. Legit. Swear by it. Whatevs. Bathroom uh, stuff, just because, you know, I live in my own home. Got to keep it clean. Next. <laughs> you guys probably don't care at all. Um... It's just a scrubbing brush and I can't remember how much this was but it was less than a pound so this is to get all the floors all good and clean and it matches my dustpan and brush because I am sad and nobody cares next <laughs> we're getting to the good stuff as long as my camera doesn't die Mr Muscle oven cleaner same as the kitchen I do swear by this I need some oven cleaner because our oven is gross next oh I'm having a great time in here I have got right oh Febreze, oh my god, vanilla latte. Yes, it was meant for Christmas. Oh, it smells, I don't know what that was. It smells so heavenly. Oh my god, it's good. It's amazing. And it's so amazing that I got the fabric spray. So this is for the, the air, this is for the curtains and the bedding and all sorts of stuff. Vanilla latte, vanilla latte. Oh my god, Febreze. Hug me up, man. I'm obsessed with Febreze. <laughs> Next. Oh, my God. The switcher. Oh, um, I'm not sure how much all these were, but they were like a pound or less. I didn't pay anything more than two pounds apart from for the cat bed. Next. Um, deodorant for Kieran, just because. Then, Dettol. Antibacterial wipes. They're my life. Antibacterial wipes. Lemon. Get it done. Get it sorted. Next. Um... <laughs> Some pillow cheese treats for the cat. They were 49p each. They're just pillow. They're just pillows. They're just treats with like cheese flavour in them. Whatever. They love them. Next, um, some toothpaste, just in case you were wondering. Um, ooh, I got myself a notebook. It was like I don't know how much this was. I think it was like one pound. Right, I ran out of storage, so I had to delete some stuff. <clears throat> this was one pound fifty. Bargain buy. Next, I was gonna say, she's gonna come running and she's already here. I got some toys for Bella. So I got this one, which is just a monkey with a with a squeaker. I can't remember how much this was. Oh, hello. Um, let me take the tags off for her. I wasn't gonna do this for all my stuff, but she wants to play with her monkey and therefore that's what she will do. And I don't want her eating all the stuff. Do you want your monkey? So I got you a monkey and I got her, so another one. These were all like something P, I can't remember, like 40, 50 P. This one, it's like, I think it's a bunny. What the hell are you? I think it's a rabbit, but it's the creepiest rabbit I've ever seen. And it's just long and floppy and, and she likes to like, like ruffle her head. I can't, I don't really know how to describe it, but she thinks she's killing them. And this one has a squeaker in its head. That one, wait, let me make sure I've got all the uh, spiky things out. Wait, 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 wait. I know you're gonna like this one. She thinks she's a freaking hunter dog. I don't want you to choke on the spiky thing. Oh, it's there. I knew it was in here. There you go. She's gonna love that. And then I got her one more, which she's not seen yet. And it's this one, it's a little, odd. it's a donkey. Now, this is like a farmyard like thing. And I just wanna say that she's already got the sheep and she's already got the cow. And now she's got the donkey. And I've got all of them now because I'm a really sad like dog parent. So now she has all the animals and she can't complain that she's like left out or whatever. Not that she has anybody to complain to. I just think they're really cute. Okay, next, last couple of things. Hoping my phone doesn't die. Your standard, like, stuff for the toilet. Love these ones. Oh, oh, yeah, guys. Oh, my God. So, Imperial Leather. If you're from England, I think, I don't know if they have them in the UK. They smell phenomenal. This one is Fruit Chew. Oh, my God. Oh, it smells like Starbursts. And then this one from Imperial Leather is Marshmallow. Oh, words can't describe. I got these in the shower ones because I, I take showers, not baths, but they have massive bottles for the bath. Like, so they have the shower ones, the bath versions. I could not recommend, oh, I freaked out. And, and, <laughs> not even that, they've got freaking soap, hand soap, marshmallow. I got the marshmallow one because I couldn't find the fruit chew one as well. I should have got all of them. I should have just got them and kept them because I reckon these are gonna go out. I reckon these like a, Oh, oh my god, it smells, they smell amazing. I, that was the most, like, excited I'd ever been about something when I walked into that shop. Okay, I only have a couple of things left, which makes me really sad. Um, and they're not really that exciting. I should have, I should have bought something exciting, but it's just a standard haul. I spent some money. I've lost track of how much I've spent. Right, 
Last, last like cleany thing was this bleach. I use it all the time. It's sparkling white crystal white gel and it's just called Easy. And I think this was like two quid or something, dunno. Then I got this cute little um, cup jar. What's it called? I don't know, but it's got a little, the little straw thing and it's pretty big. I don't drink enough water and I always spill my drinks. So I was like, you know, what? I'm gonna have to get a cup. Like, I, I need to stop buying these so I can't drop them. Anyway, this was 2 dollars I really like it. I think it's really cute. And I'm going to use that in a mo. And then last but not least, yeah, last but not least is these tennis balls. They were £1.99 something. I got them for Bella because she likes to chase them. And yeah, that's it. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how I spent 40 quid actually now I'm thinking about it. And then obviously this is the big bag <laughs> for... It was a pound. This bag is a pound. Look at it. It's huge. I, I'm obsessed with it. I just take that and I fit everything in there. So yeah, that's my haul. I'm sorry that I look such a mess. I wish I'd made more of an effort now that I filmed this, but I don't want to film it again. And I've taken the tags on everything. But yeah, I'm really impressed with myself. And I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I'm sorry that I've been away for so long. I promise I'll be coming back. I'm kind of revamping my channel at the moment. I think I'm gonna go down the the <laughs> I'm gonna go down the road of like hauls and like uh stuff I bought and whatever, just because that's interesting to me and I know that it will be interesting to some of you. So if you like this video and you're interested in, in seeing more hauls and seeing <laughs> and seeing different things from me, then make sure to give it a massive thumbs up and to subscribe. And I promise you I'll be back really, really soon when I've decided to waste even more money. Oh my god, that was unnecessary. Right, I'll see you all very soon and I love you all lots. Goodbye!